Look how we begin. What's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. Marco here for another North Star Boys reaction. Last night, I got to react to their brand new song, Jet Black. Today, I get to react to the music video for Jet Black. I've been waiting by my computer all day for this. Holy shit, that's fucking hot. Holy fuck. <laughs> I made myself a fresh cup of coffee so I could get into the mood. And we're here. We're here. And we're beginning with... Uh, an ad, an ad for their tour, live in Cydia, sold out. This is great. This is great. You know, this takes me back to how um, pop acts used to promote their tours in like the late 90s, mid to late 90s, early 2000s. They would release the first single off an album. And then the second single was released usually two or three months later to promote the tour that was coming up. And we're kind of doing the same thing here with North Star Boys. This is so fucking cool. Okay, guys, let's get into this. I am so excited. If you want to watch any of my previous North Star Boys reactions, please do so in the North Star Boys playlist. The link to that is in the description below. Let's get into this, baby. Jet Black and SB, here we go. Puppeteered in the teaser. Fuck. Oh, oh, oh. So they're sitting in the audience. Oh no, they don't look happy. Fuck. Ooh. Sebastiano, I knew it was him. Whoa, 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 what the f Oh, fuck! <laughs> there is no fucking way. There is no fucking way. There is no fucking way. There is no fucking... Something, 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 dark side. <laughs> I had a feeling it was Sebastian singing this part. When I reacted to the song, I was like, whose part is this? Whose part does this belong to? Oh my God, they sound so good. Fuck. Confirmation, baby. Confirmation. So who are these guys in the red fucking hoods here? Ah. Red Hoods, Red Seats, and uh, the boys are putting on a show against their will. They're being puppeteered. They're putting on a show for uh, these fuckers in hoods. And oh my God, there is some sort of story going on here. But I'm wondering if it's connecting to anything else, if it's connecting to any of their other music videos. I'm trying to think, I'm trying to think, I'm trying to think. This should all be fresh and new for me. <laughs> ah! All right, do we have the English? Do we... Uh... Not really. Okay, okay, let's do this again. Let's do this again. Oh, 
I love the masks. So I know that Kane has the blue hair and I love it, but I love that Ryan has uh, blue streaks in his hair. So it's not totally blue like Kane's, but I like that contrast. I like how the black is breaking up the blue, especially with the white mask. It's such a great color scheme. So are they saying blue world? I asked this when I was reacting to the song blue world. I don't. Okay. Rule the world? Are they saying rule the world? Rule the world? Oh, interesting. In guys, correct me if I'm wrong. Initially, when I was listening to the song, when I reacted to the song, I thought, are they saying blue world? Because I was envisioning like the cityscape at night with the moon in blue. I was like, wait, what's the connection with blue world? But they're saying rule the world. Rule the world! It's a run-on sentence, right? Rule the, rule the world. So I love that. I love that. And it makes sense with the aesthetics that we're getting here in this video, because it seems like these guys are being controlled. They're puppeteered. They're imprisoned in some fashion by these fuckers in hoods, in these fuckers in red hoods. And I don't know, bro. Are they the rulers of the world? These hooded figures? Rule the world! Oh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. I just want to take this in. And we have multiple things happening in the sky here. We have like a different planet or planet Earth from the distance and the moon. Like, I don't even know what's happening. <gasps> oh, City of PD. They are creating some sort of universe. I'm telling you right now, they are creating some sort of universe with Cydia. They are creating some sort of universe. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe that that's what's happening. Yes, yes, yes. I love these shots. I love these shots. Ooh, ooh, ooh. See, I do, oh, 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 I do wish that we got, okay. <laughs> Hear me out. I wish we got more of the city shots. I know this stuff takes time and it's pretty expensive. I totally get it, but okay, okay, okay. The nails, the nails, the pink nail, the black nail. Have we seen that in other videos from them? Has there been maybe another member, maybe another character with a pink and black nail? Yes or no? Find out for me. That is your mission. That is your assignment. Find out for me. If not, this is the beginning of something new, baby. Yes, it is. Bang! Make it club, make it go bang, bang. I'm clapping, when I'm asshole. Saying, when I see you in the back, black, sit back, bang, bang. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy, bro. This reminds me of The Godfather. Oh, see, black and pink nail polish yeah this reminds me of the godfather if you know the godfather signal uh symbol uh on the cover uh it's the hand with um i don't know what they're called but like it's puppeteering it's puppeteering as a kid growing up watching the godfather as one naturally does <laughs> i always thought that it was the cross the crucifix and that's kind of the double meaning it is a cross it is a crucifix but it's also puppeteering i don't know the the specific term for this, I apologize. Uh, maybe I do and I just completely forgot. But yeah, the puppeteering that's going on. Yeah, yeah, I love this. I love this. I love this. When I see you in the back, jet black, sit back, bang, bang. Bang, yo. So I do like the way that they're standing with their legs, uh, their knees kind of inverted here. And um, the dress pants being a bit more oversized and elongated because it kind of shrinks the guys a bit. And, uh, you know, I don't know how tall or short any of these guys are. Uh, not that that even matters, but for them to look more like puppets being puppeteered, they've kind of done this little trick with the pants to elongate the pants, make the pants a little baggier, a little longer, to stunt the guy's heights. And I love that because you buy it even more so. There's something really uncanny about the way everybody looks in these wide shots here. Make it go bang bang. When I'm saying, when 
So, Kane is the first, I believe, to have his mask taken off. Oh my god, bro, his voice, like, if I just, I'm, I'm blown away every time that I find out that it's him. It's his part, because I'm like, where is this coming from? Whiplash? Wait, wait, I said lip lash. Jaguar. Oh, oh, Jaguar. Jaguar print. Woo! Blue world. I see, I said blue world. Rule the world. Rule the world. There you go. Oh man, oh man, oh man. So he has the mask taken off. Oh, the bang ain't as banging as it was before. There's a struggle. There, you can definitely see the struggle here. Um, the struggle of what's happening with these guys trying to uh, break out. Oh, oh my God. Look at this shot. This shot here. Has this been in another video? Because this looks like it's a shot from the beach. If you look at the water behind him and the sky. Um, um, uh, something's connecting and I, I don't know what it is. I feel like I do, but I don't. So yeah, we have Darren. I love the hazy, the hazy in and out, out of focus editing here. And you can really see that he's, his energy is being depleted because yeah, the banging is not as banging as it was. It's not as banging as it was before. They're not, they're not impressed anymore. These assholes. See, yeah, getting angry, getting frustrated, getting impatient. Sebastian, bro, bro, Sebastian, bro, your part here, it just, it. I, I, Oh, his voice so good. Break it free, break it free. Rule the world. They're leaving. You know what's crazy? It's crazy that these guys are not impressing them. And they've had enough of their fucking show, or lack thereof, they think, the hooded figures think, that they just get up and leave. They get up and leave, leaving the guys to just fucking stay there, unattended, in prison, tied up. Like, who's going to come pick them up after? <laughs> you know? That's crazy, bro. They just so happen to break loose. They, I mean, what if they never broke loose? I would like to have a word with your manager because, <laughs> because I love this so much. <laughs> oh, the aspect ratio widens and now we have the full screen here. Oh my God. Oh my God. I don't know. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy, bro. I love the acting. I love the acting in all their videos. Honestly, like so good. So good. I don't, I don't know what happened. How did they end up here? How did they end up here? Wait a minute. 
wait a minute, no, no, my mind is running in circles right now. My mind is running in circles right now. Wait a minute. Are they wearing what they wore in Kissing Booth? Wait a fucking minute. Yo. You. The pink pants. The pink jacket. The pink jacket is Reggie. Is it not? The pink pants is Oliver. Is it not? Are they not wearing what they wore? I know I'm yelling a lot. I'm sorry, but not really. Sorry, not sorry. Are they wearing what they wore in Kissing Booth? If so. Let's just say they are. Hypothetically, let's just say they are. What does this mean? What does this mean? What does this mean? Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. Let me brainstorm. Let me brainstorm. Does Kissing Booth, the story, the narrative, whatever happened in Kissing Booth, does that take place in the timeline before Jet Black? Does Jet Black take place in the timeline before kissing booth i don't know but i'm gonna start a fight because this is gonna drive me fucking crazy oh my god oh my god oh my god i'm trying to think what other music videos have they been on a beach panic right at the end of panic they end up on a beach i don't forget all that forget all that this is a new era so we have to kissing booth is the introduction of this new era so i we can only go off of kissing booth right 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 oh this is so good this is so good oh my god this is so good i have no idea if what i'm saying even makes any sense but if i'm onto something guys you have got to let me know if you know anyone out there if you know let me know oh my god this was so good this was so good and you see how just just showing up on a beach lying down in the sand being washed ashore, just wearing similar, if not the exact same clothing, completely changes the context, the weight of everything. Just like that. Just like that. You don't need so much to mean everything in a music video, right? You don't need to overdo it. And I don't care if people overdo it because I love the shot, the hair, Ryan. I don't care if people overdo it in music videos because I fucking love that. But simplicity also goes along fucking way oliver knows that yes he does <laughs> this is so fucking sick guys what are your thoughts on the song what are your thoughts on this music video of jet black please let me know in the comments below would love to hear your thoughts cannot wait for the album cannot wait for the tour cannot wait for anything and everything these guys are throwing our way oh my god this is so good wow the foreboding in this music video and the song itself i did say when i reacted to the song that um jet black feels like a darker more brooding cousin of kissing booth kissing booth to me was the foreplay all right uh jet black is the getting right to business the smashy dashy you know what i mean the smash and the dash <laughs> so uh, take that how you will how you may <laughs> that's gonna be it for today guys thank you so very much for spending all this time with me to so check out some brand new north star boys with jet black this was phenomenal the guys are phenomenal cannot wait for more and we're going to be getting more really 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 soon that's it that's all guys until then take care of yourselves take care of each other and we'll speak again real soon take care guys <laughs>